everyone, and welcome back to my channel and to episode six of my Monday mini series where we featured all our five below find items as well as our anchor items, which were the Rainbow Bright 40th anniversary minifigures, also, of course, from Five Below. It's been fun. This is the last episode to complete this series, which means at the end of the video, I will bring out all our finds that we opened over the course of the past six weeks, which was a lot of fun, but went by really quick too. Here's our remaining six items from our bin. We have Sailor Moon Crystal, Cute Tito's, Care Bears, Magic Mixie Mixlings, Bears vs. Donuts, and of course, our very lovable stallion, Starlight. And we'll start with Starlight. I need to go back and watch that toy hunt video where I found these because this one's also the Rare Chase. Didn't even realize it. I did that with Twink as well, so that's, that's pretty awesome. Okay. These are very easy to pop out of the box and store back in the packaging, which I really want to do because it's just so magical. Starlight is Rainbow Bright's magical flying horse and very best friend. He loves Rainbow very much and always watches out for her safety and well-being. He gives her help and advice and takes her any place she wants to go, whether it's for fun or the cause of color. And he has a very cute pose. I do like his mane and tail, like blowing in the wind. He has his yellow hooves. Of course, the star on his forehead there. Very cool. Now, even though it says rare chase, I'm not sure. Like, he doesn't feel flogged. I'm not sure what the chase component is. So if any of you know, feel free to let me know. But what a cool figure. Next up, we have another retro return, which are the Care Bears. And this is series two of the little minifigure capsule. And inside, oh, we have Tenderheart Bear. <laughs> Two little double piece paws there. That's really cute. I love Tenderheart. And then. Here's a look at the checklist. Yeah, I don't think they have any different rarities. Let's grab a plushie next with our Bears vs. Donuts blind bag. Five Below is such a great place for all like the Versus World and the Pop Art Softs. They have so many of these little blind bags. So first up is our checklist. Oh, it's been a while since I opened the Bears vs. Donuts and I absolutely love them. I love them so much. <laughs> <laughs> that would be awesome if we got Rainbow Bear. And inside, oh, we have one associated with clouds. We have Hot Air Bear, which looks really cute. And look at how happy they look. Oh, there's balloons on the back, too. Oh, yeah, that's pretty, pretty fitting. And it says the sky's the limit. Very cute. And I dug out my checklist, which we've made a lot of progress. And yes, we needed Hot Air Bear. So welcome little friend, and we have like a bingo going across now. <laughs> Another collab I would love to see would be Rainbow Bright and Sailor Moon. I just think they're, they're made for each other in, in many ways. So here's the five you can find as little mini acrylic stands, which I was really excited to, to find these at five below from Sailor Moon Crystal, which just finished up um, recently. And then... They are taped and they're pretty secure, which is nice. So inside, oh, we have Sailor Venus. Looking really cute. So you just have the print on one side and then you also have the base, which you can pop them into. Okay, I feel like there's a certain way it snaps in like so and just really cute. A cute way to display one-dimensional art and acrylic stands are, are pretty popular right now and have grown on me too as well as the acrylic keychains down to two more items let's save our magic mixie for last because of the water and let's grab our island Eidos, cutitos these are again the five below blind bags which don't come with a blanket or card i would love the little pelican or this little bird a seabird oh there's a manta ray too okay they're all pretty cute I think we have the little ray. Yes. Oh, okay. Look at all the bubbles. <sighs> this one's adorable. Okay, that's pretty perfect. They have their tongue sticking out too. 
How cute is that? They're really soft. So we're just gonna call this one Ray Ito. <laughs> so cute. And he's a so tutti fruity, which I think are the commons. They have three commons. I know they mix it up a little bit with the the current series with like kawaii Itos and fruititos, but uh, very very cute. New to my collection, and very happy to have them. Well, I guess you can see the tongue sticking out there. So he looks a lot like his art. So cute in person with all those bubbles. My goodness. <laughs> And then last up for this video is the Magic Mixy Mixlings Magicus Party, which is the newest series, and I was so happy to see these at Five Below. Five Below, you can also find some of Crystal Woods there as well. But um, yes, I love these, and I've pretty much decided that this series, the Magicus Party, is my favorite of, of the four. I mean, they're all good, but this one, there's just something special about the, the, the whimsy and pastel colors that I adore, so much so that... I am going to continue my Monday mini series next week, and I will say that um, this will be a little hint, <laughs> perhaps, at what it will entail. You'll have to find out next Monday for, for the rest. Okay, so inside we have our potion. Again, just so cute. So we have our water, our beautiful potion, and I know there's some new items coming out from Magic Mixies this year, which is really exciting, but I do hope they always keep their little cauldron and magic potion, because that has just been so awesome and unique to them from the start. So here we go, Magicus Mixis. And then inside, let's grab that out. That's the only part, <laughs> is pushing that aside. <laughs> so first up, we have our little baggie. And then we have, oh, are you kidding me? <gasps> I was like, what accessory is that? We have the little disco ball guy. <gasps> I think he's like the limited edition, the ultra rare. Oh my goodness. How cute. Okay, eek. <laughs> what a way to end this mini series if that is the case. Is it Xander is his name? Oh my goodness, guys. Oh my goodness. Look, look at this magical wand. So cute. So, so cute. So cute. Where are you? Yes, we found Xander. Only available in Collector's Cauldron, the limited edition one. Oh, that is my first limited edition. Magic Mixie Mixlings. And yet again, Magic is Party coming through. Look at how cute. Oh. Okay, well, I am just, just speechless right now. Oh, they even have a tag, which, whoo! <laughs> Be careful with those scissors. Oh my goodness. How adorable. They're actually numbered? What? Congratulations, you have found a limited edition Xander. 1,425 out of 5,000. Oh. oh, you precious thing, you. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I had no idea. They're like the old, like, Shopkins, like, numbered like that, since these are made by Moose Boys. He has, he has hair? <laughs> How, okay, I gotta clean my fingers because they're still wet before before I touch him and we'll take a closer look. Okay, he's just absolutely perfect. So he's perched atop the cute little ball that's gonna light up. There is a non-replaceable battery component that will activate with our wand. He has cute little wings. Look at the tail. I love the, the curly tail with the tinsel. And then of course the amazing detail on the ears little antlers, the eye makeup design. I love it so, so much. And even the blue has a metallic sheen to it. That is just an absolutely stunning limited edition. And here's the code on his cauldron, which I realize is also a very short number. 
So there you go. If, if they're all like that, if he's number 31723, I know sometimes the code's changed um, for the second waves, but maybe look for a short number. So I, I wish you all the best in, in your hunt. And I'll dim the lights. We'll put him in the dark if he glows, but I think he plays music too. So here we go. We pulled the tab. Oh my goodness. Okay, that is so cute. It is like a little disco ball he's sitting on. Perfect for the Magicus party. Well, that was quite the grand finale to this Monday mini series, but do feel free to let me know which was your favorite item from today. Of course, Xander just stole the show from me and my heart. My goodness, Starlight's a little jealous, but I am so thankful to add him to my collection. Stunning, amazing, and they did a great, great job. And here are all our five below finds that we opened over the last six weeks. I do have a Monday mini series playlist if you want to check those out for previous series as well. I love how the Rainbow Bright figures go easily back in their package. They look super cool displayed and stacked like that. And I'm just so happy we were so lucky and what a fun series to, to gather and to open. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did making it. And of course, if you did, feel free to give this video a thumbs up. And I thank you so, so much for sticking around, watching my videos, and just hanging out with me. I really, really appreciate it. And I do hope to see you in the next one. I think I found my mascot for our next Monday mini series. So until then, friends, take care. Bye bye.